forgot on how to start. Hello ladies and gents, welcome back to my channel. Sorry it's been so long since I've been on here. Um, I have no excuse really, because uh, I have spent the past six months at home, but I'm back now and that's what matters and we've got some exciting things ahead. And because of all these exciting things, I thought it was only fitting to kind of jump on here and do a bit of an update slash forecast. I think that's the wrong word. Just update about what is going on and what is happening in my life. So I cannot remember the last time that I uploaded or what the last thing I uploaded on here was. But if you didn't know, I'm currently on a gap year. So finished my A-levels literally about eight months ago now. And the whole point of this gap year was to go traveling or is to go traveling. But obviously in order to go traveling, I needed to save up quite a lot of money um, to fund it. And so that is what I've been doing for the past couple of months, which is why I have not posted on here at all, because I feel like everything that I was doing was so boring, was so like repetitive that there was no point making like long vlogs or anything like that because I was like I was just boring myself at that point do you know what I mean if I'm completely honest I've been way more active on TikTok over the past couple of months so here's my shameless little plug uh if you want to see what I've been up to if you want to see some mini daily vlogs that I've done pop over to my TikTok but I have neglected the wonderful space that is YouTube but that no more no more. It was actually one of my New Year's resolutions to basically start focusing on social media a little bit more and like actually trying to be regular with content upload. So I don't want to make false promises but I'm hoping and I'm really really like genuinely trying to make sure that I don't go missing for another four or five months again. But I think that was all just a really long-winded way of saying I'm back, I'm sorry for disappearing and the past couple months of my life haven't been super eventful. So I think it is only right if I tell you all the exciting things that are up and coming that are going to happen in the next couple of months of my life that hopefully if not definitely, that you will be seeing with me. I'm not 100% sure when I'm uploading this video, but currently it's the start of February. And I am about to go traveling around Southeast Asia, which is so exciting and absolutely terrifying. It's something that I think I've been speaking about for like a year and a half wanting to do when I thought about taking a gap year. This is kind of what the goal was. And now it's happening like really soon. So I am traveling for seven weeks before coming home and I'm going to Thailand, Vietnam, Cambodia and Bali. So I'm spending roughly two weeks in Thailand, two weeks in Vietnam, like a week in Cambodia and then about two weeks in Bali. That's not the exact amount of time that I'm staying out in each place, but it gives you a rough idea. And I'm going alone. I'm going solo. Not only am I just going solo, I'm going backpacking as well. So I've got a 70 litre backpack. So like think about like a D of E rucksack. Um, so I've got one of those and I'm flying out all by myself and I'm meeting up with groups out there. So for my whole, for the whole of the Southeast Asia trip for all four countries that I'm going to, I've done it all through Gap 360. And so while I am going solo traveling i'm not alone while i'm out there which gives me a little bit of peace of mind um although i am yet to talk to anyone who is going to be out there at the same time as me so it's it's a, it's a weird feeling because you know that you're going alone but you know that you're going to meet i'm sure some amazing people out there but i actually have no clue who they are at this point 
it's just a bit crazy it is just a bit crazy while i'm out there i'm planning on vlogging as much as possible filming as much as possible uh not only for my memories but also because I mean, I'm nosy, I like to see what other people are doing and hopefully it will be interesting, you know, going solo as like a young woman um, and just like the gap year experience just for people to kind of see, I guess. But not only am I travelling around the four countries in Asia, I am also going on a tour of Europe. I would list all the places that I'm going to in Europe, however, it is 16 countries in 45 days and I cannot list all of those places off the top of my head. That is another six weeks, um, which is a week after my Asia trip, if that makes sense. So I fly out, do Thailand, Vietnam, Cambodia, Bali, come home, have a week at home, and then I head down to London to start my European adventure, which is six weeks long. I am also doing that solo and I'm also doing that with a company, with a different company though. I'm doing it with Contiki. First one's with Gap360, Europe's with Contiki. And I will be taking the same rucksack, uh, but just with maybe some slightly different clothes in them. So I am obviously going to vlog as much of that trip as well. So there's just going to be a lot of travel content in the next couple of months, probably, um, which is super exciting. And then I think I'll just have to see what life is like. That sounds so weird to say, but I think four months and four months of traveling alone and experiencing so much of the world, like, it's just, it's just gonna change me. Do you know what I mean? I'm going on my gap yard, I'm experiencing it, and I'm just gonna like find just inner peace and all of that. I don't know. I'm gonna experience something though, and it's gonna be crazy. And I think after my travels, I am just gonna have to figure out what's going on for the summer at least, because then once summer is over, I'm starting university, which also sounds crazy, especially because pretty much all of my friends have already been at university for nearly a whole year. They've nearly finished their first year of university, which is crazy. And therefore it is insane that I will be starting university. And I just think the next couple of months are going to be the most crazy, the most hectic, and just the most life altering from what I know now to what I will know in the next couple of months. Like, I genuinely cannot fathom it. The plan is to take you along with me for all of it because I like talking to myself slash to you. I've missed you. I've missed you. I will say it's going to take a little bit of getting used to picking up like the camera again and talking to it because I haven't done it in so long and I also think that even though it's so exciting that so much of my life will be changing or like new experiences and all of that sometimes like, it almost makes it harder to film because I think everyone likes to appear like they're put together and they know what they're doing and I just won't for like a while and I think that's a little bit scary to like show the world I guess put it out onto the internet sphere, even though it's just my little corner of the internet, like I'm still putting it out there. And I think it's a little bit scary to like, admit that you kind of don't know what you're doing and that you're scared, but we're just gonna do it because this is what I want to do. And 2023 is about doing more of what you want to do. So hello, my name is Emma. I am 19 years old. I'm a girl who loves all things makeup, fashion, lifestyle and travel. I am currently a gap year student and I am so excited to welcome you to my channel. Thank you for listening to me ramble for the past however long. I am genuinely grateful for you watching these videos. If you would like to give it a like or subscribe or all that jazz, you know what to do. It just lets me know what you like, what you don't like, what you want to see more from me, etc. Um, 
but I'm happy to be back and to be sitting in front of a camera again. So I promise I will see you very, very soon with another video.